Hi, nice to have you here again. This is Vertical Response for a plugin by contactus.com. Our newest plugin provides beautiful newsletter forms that can be implemented either as a tab or as an inline form on websites created on WordPress. Yet again, offering multiple template options for both inline and tab newsletter forms. It only takes a few steps to install the plugin. As you can see here, we are uploading the files from the plugin on the WordPress panel. These files can be found on the WordPress plugin directory or you can just look it up on the WordPress panel and type vertical response form plugin by contactus.com so once you're done with installing and activating the plugin it will look something like this so this plugin is for vertical response users but if you don't have an account you can create one directly from the plugin it only takes a few steps to sign up so you only need an email address and choose a password Right after completing the sign-up process, you need to click here to send a vertical response request form. So you need to fill all the information on this form and this will enable your API key on your vertical response account. Once your API has been enabled, you will receive this confirmation email from vertical response. So that step is very essential. Don't forget to complete it. Otherwise, you won't be able to continue to step number two. This is a basic step where you need to select your client list and input your first name and last name. After that, click on continue to step 3. In this part, a contactus.com account will be created under the email address you're using on vertical response. The objective of this account is to customize your newsletter form instead of using the default template. So here's the plugin's main panel, where you are able to choose the implementation you want. We have inline newsletter form or site tab implementation available. We even have a custom implementation available where you are able to select what type of implementation you want to have on each of the pages of your WordPress website. So after saving your changes, you can click here to preview how the tab looks. As you can see, I have it on the left side as a tab. If I click it, you can see one of the templates where it asks for name and email address. Preview the inline form as well. Here is embedded on one of the pages of my WordPress website. After deciding what you want, make sure to save the changes. If you click here, you are able to see many of the templates we have available for the newsletter inline form. If you click here, you can see the templates available for the tab. So if you're wondering how to customize the newsletter form, Log in to your Contact Us account. Once you're in the panel, go to Form Settings. Here, you will find the vertical response information and you will see the default template. If you want to customize, click on Configure Form. So once you're here, you can start customizing your newsletter form as you wish. Here, I'm changing the main title to contactus.com. We have some additional settings where it allows you to modify the call to action text. Another option we have available is to use either a capture code or not. One of the most important parts is the form template section. Here you're able to select the template that best fits your needs. So make sure to try out all the templates until you're happy with the one you chose. Scroll down to select either to have the newsletter appear immediately or with a click. Then save your advance. So the same thing goes with the tab settings. Select the template you like best, scroll down and you can choose the tab position. So select the side that suits best for you and don't forget to save. Here we have some other options. These are the mobile settings and how you want the form to appear. This is the configuration for the newsletter form on Facebook. Here you need to input your Facebook credentials to connect it with the plugin. This part allows you to configure the thank you message you will send to all your new subscribers. You can also configure a follow-up email to let your new subscribers know you received their information. So that covers the newsletter configuration. The final step is to save and publish your changes. We hope you enjoy this great plugin.